Hello, back again, um, and today we're just going to have a quick video uh, about uh, the new base, because so I've decided to move over to this concrete base that we were making in the last video, so I've got uh, a couple of turrets up defending it and stuff, um, everything's just crammed down here at the minute, um, back to back, nicely laid out, so it's using up as much space as possible, but this is the main point of the thing today, I've laid out in wood a test sort of gauntlet for the enemies, and we're going to try this out now. I did briefly try it with less straps and stuff, and they managed to um, kill that thing. It doesn't actually destroy the structure, but it just um, resets the timer kind of thing, if you were wondering what happens when you lose. Um, so I put a circuit breaker up here, which will turn on the system, or should do. Boot it up, bang, bang, bang. That's on, that's on. Electric's on. I haven't tested that out. Um, so perfect, because I put the lights up, because at night time, we'll need to see the um oh i can hear the electric making some noise we'll need to see what's uh, going on um where we're shooting at and stuff like that i don't mean to put 32 so we've done that we've done that and i think the servers are going down pretty soon oh i just need to avoid that meat grinder so i'm gonna trigger this um yeah we've got about 20 minutes i can't remember how long the timer is so i'm just gonna um trigger this uh e pressing the wrong button Round eight we're on, by the way. Hopefully I've got enough bullets. So the beacon is now over here. You don't have to put it right near it, and that allows you to... Um, uh, uh, what was I saying? It allows you to place things, traps. So we couldn't place it before when the beacon was here, if you remember. So this... They seem to be getting blended up here. These bears are new as well. They're right buggers. Try and kill them as soon as possible. They do tend to make it through. Although they're not doing it now. The electric's being pretty effective. Sweet. Uh, they're firing at... Ah, it's got some coming through. Okay, bear made it through. Big guy made it through. Flamethrowers not hitting them from there. For some reason. They do have ammo? Yeah. Okay. Get a quick reload. I'll try and get them as they're coming through. I'll put a flamethrower at the start to apply... I think it applies a burn effect, but we'll find out. Um, what's the health looking like? We're already half dead, which is annoying. Um, come on. There. They're one down. There two is attacking that. Okay, cool. Down. If I can get these headshots. Seems to get the bear down. The, the the little puny NPCs just don't seem to be making it through, so I can actually ignore them. It's these that I want. made it through. Is it actually being attacked? Yeah, it is. It is being attacked by the blades, but it doesn't seem to do too much damage to them. Um, I think this is the play then. Just aim for big, big guy, and then take out the bears as we can. Um, still on half health, so that wave didn't actually get us there. So the electric, I think, is working, because it seems to be changing animation. We'll double check when the little puny guys come through in a sec. Uh, let's probably eat some food while we're here. Oh, wrong time. There, right. Oh god, are they gonna get in the way? Okay, well they're not making it through, so that's pretty cool. They're coming through. Ah, this is a new enemy type as well. See that assassin there? That's not hitting him. Fine, I think the shotgun might have got him. Uh, so I think it's hitting the blades when I'm shooting this gun. Yeah, see there? Oh, this is annoying. Right, okay. Coming down. He's got off some good hits there, to be honest. Oh, we did it. Just in time. 
Sweet. So, effective. Um, so they're basically, this gap is um, kind of like one um, foundation apart. Um, I wasn't actually able to put a foundation across here. So what I did is I put a, before I had this side on, I put a column here, put a um, floor across there, and then I was able to place a foundation here, and then I could delete the column and the floor there, which enabled me to keep this all kind of lined up. And it's the same with down here, where I'm on the edge of a cliff, stupidly. I should have thought a bit better about doing it. Um, I had to actually just use pillars here rather than foundations. It wouldn't let me put them down until I got to this point here. So that's a little tip for you if you're having trouble uh, having trouble trying to line them up. Try it with using pillars and floors to get it lined up and then add the foundations on where you can. So I'm just going to turn off the system so I don't get blended up by the spikes while I'm looting and stuff. So the system should power down now. Yeah. Still got... Oh no, there we go. It's gone. Do a quick loot here. Nothing in that one. Should be over here that's got more in, I think. There we go. That's what we like to see. Uh, don't need that. I will have the books. Um, I'll take them. Take a knife. Bone played a bit of a wheat. That's fine. Have a look in these remains. Uh, like it there. And these ones. I'll have to have a think about where I stand. Um, if As soon as they start getting through, I will come down here maybe, I think. Or I'll put some guns here, some uh, flint locks, Because I couldn't get the shots down there. It was hitting either this um, hitbox or the hitbox of this. It was clipping it. So that's something to think about. But yeah, that is the gauntlet that we made so far uh the base like i said here we, we're defending it from both sides sort of thing i'll probably put a gun on the other side um if you made it this far then thank you for watching if you can subscribe that'd be great it really helps me out a lot on the channel and i do really really appreciate it so thanks if you do and if not then that's fine too um okay i think i'll leave it there because the server is just about to come down i'll just switch this on one more time so we can have a look and i will see you on the next one um we'll probably extend this gauntlet at some point and just before i go i'll also show you um when you actually start building at your base on the space time base you can actually hold it and go down to this one and you can upgrade it and that increases your uh radius that you can build in i believe and it must also add durability i'll have to check that at the moment we're on 20 at the minute so um we'll check that out next time uh and see how it works and all that that's fine um cool all right then cheers guys and yeah see you on the next one Bye bye